It is day three in Poland, and we are going to get McDonald's. It's Christmas, actually, so Merry Christmas. Um, but I wanted to try the McDonald's here because the McDonald's in Amsterdam was a little different, too. So I guess it, even if it goes to one, it'll end up going to zero. But we were up since, like, 6 a.m., Oh yeah, well I was up for a while, but it was like raining. All the snow is gone now. It's like sprinkling. In our walk, we found a McDonald's like right down the street from us. So that's where we're going. To our surprise, because my tour guide was so horrible and told me that everything was gonna be closed for the next three days, but it actually isn't and a lot of places are still open. I know, do you want a donut? I didn't get it from here. I got it from over here. So. But they have like a lot of these donut places and they're all like women in like like tank tops. <laughs> oh, let's go into the souvenir shop too. So uh, basically you lied. <laughs> they said everything was going to be closed. You look it up online too. It's, it, they said everything was going to be closed. Yay. Oh, it's all like self-serve. Okay, breakfast duo. Ooh, that looks good. A scrambled egg with pork, oh my God. That looks, oh, they have it with mushrooms and bacon and avocado. What? This is what I'll say, I, yeah. I might get that one. Yeah, yeah. Multi-green, but they don't have pancakes. <laughs> breakfast, or like. No. Sweet, sweet breakfast? Oh, yeah. Oh, they have oh, croissants. I want to try this. Cocoa. That's interesting. They have an oat cookie. Oh, my God. They have Oreo McFlurry. Oh, we know. What? Mars. Oh, they have it like... I wonder if their ice cream is the same here. I actually want to try like cheese stuff here. Hold on, hold on. I, want to, I want to get this. Okay. It's the time of the Mm. It's so good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. It's so good. What's cheese? Oh, is this, the, is this the sheep cheese or whatever? No, but it smells really weird that I don't want to eat it. Smell it. But you made me pay for it, so. That's cheese. It, it just smells like the bacon. Mm, yeah. You're not a fan. I can tell. We don't have to get it again. Not to worry. Dick, taste this. I will. <laughs> you're, you're probably supposed to eat it with cranberry or something. <laughs> it's, nah. it's like rubbery. Nice, cheese. I'm gonna throw up. The first one? Okay. Yeah. So we are back at the market once again. He's getting that for me because I really wanted to try it. Let's go. Ooh, that smell though. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's awesome. it's like <gasps> I hate birds and there are so many birds today. It's like all the birds forgot to exist up until today. Wait, let's walk over there. We've seen all of this stuff already. There's like so many people here today. And Sam said that this place was gonna be closed. Okay. This smells like my grandma's like, when she makes the pomegranate wine and it turns into vinegar. Oh, it is super hot though.
How much? How much was this? Fifteen zloty. So like. Three like and a half. four dollars. Or four. Yeah. No, no, three, three and a half. This is disgusting. Very uh, acquired taste. It's like, throw it away, throw it away. I'm not gonna throw it away, but kind of tastes like you know that red, red, big red gum, the cinnamon stick yeah, gum. Yeah. Kind of tastes like that, and then you get like a really strong whiff of like the wine, and it like hurts. That's crazy. I did not see that. <laughs> oh, Bedronka. That's what you said the market, right? Yeah. Maybe Bedronka just means market. Cause, uh... <laughs> oh my gosh. So we're at this like Taiwanese spot. And I'm trying Polish beer for the first time. Man, I don't know. Oh my gosh, it's gonna pop. Oh, thank you. Am I the only one with this problem? Okay. Oh, yeah? The bulb is a little hard, but. Oh, it's good. I really like it. I wish it was more cold. You wish you, you just got the Christian beer. Shut up. It's an experience. Yeah. Okay. So we got Taiwanese beef noodle and Taiwanese chili wontons with meat, a beer, and a milk tea, and the total came out to be. American USD, $28 and something cents. But in Zalati, it's $106. Does it say 28 I saw it on the other receipt. Oh. But I want to know, is this a lot of money for Zalati? Like, can everyone afford this? Yeah? Oh. What's the minimum wage here? You don't know. 610 euros per month. So 3,600 uh, zloty per month. But this was a hundred dollars. 3,600 zloty. It's like 900 per month. 900 USD per month. If I have 900 USD and I spend 30 dollars on a meal, that's a lot. No? Mm -hmm. Well, that's minimum wage, so I'm sure. Oh. Ooh, yeah, it does smell good. Rate it. It's it reminds me of uh, that one place we tried. That was really bad. Like. Ooh! But it's not bad. It has like a strong. I don't know. What It has a strong ginger flavor. Mm. Mm. It almost tastes like curry. You kind of see which one. That's right. Honey. Mm. Honey. Mm. 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 You don't have to show my failures, okay? Can I take it out, please? Oh, the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, thank you. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. Mm. 
This one doesn't taste bad either. Yeah. It doesn't taste like amazing, but it's really not bad. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. So I'm feeling quite sick today and I don't have like a sore throat but it's like very scratchy and like phlegmy already and like I was having cold sweats all night and I was sleeping in my Snuggie and it was really hot. So luckily we found the Starbucks yesterday um, that's right across the street from our hotel. So I'm hoping that it's open right now, and then I'm just gonna go and get some like sick tea from my throat, cause it's just so like scratchy. It does, it's not like a sore throat, which that's a good thing, but still, look how beautiful it is. It feels like a movie, like what? It feels fake. I feel like I'm inside like, is it the Venetian in Vegas? Like, this is also our last night in our hotel and we're gonna be moving to an Airbnb. We only wanted to stay here for Christmas so we have like quick access to the Christmas market, which honestly was really beautiful and I'm glad we experienced it once. The food was really nasty for the most part. One thing I've noticed about the restaurants here in Krakow is that they all have like these really cute outside stands where you can eat. And it's like, I don't know if it was here because of COVID, but it's like actually made of like plexiglass or glass. Um, so it was like strong winds yesterday, but it was super sturdy. So this is a Starbucks and right across the way is our hotel so we just found out about the starbucks yesterday while walking and i was like oh my gosh because there's the starbucks a little further away but again like these tents are so amazing and it does look open so let's go i don't know are they open oh push you're an idiot okay Let's see. Hmm. I do need water, but it's fine. Hello. Hi. Do you guys have medicine ball? Honey citrus tea with mint? No? Okay, give me one second. Um, I'll just do your green tea. Which size? A grande, please. You take away. Take away. Sam. Okay, so they don't have sick tea. And they don't have the equivalent to make sick tea. Which is fine because... It's more English, so they had like Earl Grey, London, something, I don't know. But either way, a green tea is perfectly fine. So I'm just going to walk around the market for the last time because it's kind of hot now. And I'm like sweating. I'm sweating, but I'm still cold. So oh, should I just go back inside? I don't know. Oh, come. Oh. Yeah, come. <laughs> I know, but it's okay. Yeah, I'm too lazy. Oh, 
You want to go to this one? Look how nice it is. It's so beautiful. Really, they got a good spot. Yeah. Like, if it wasn't for like the parking situation, it like... But hey, at least it was free during the time yeah, we were yeah, yeah. So we've got some macarons, we got chocolate, pistachio, and uh, is this raspberry? Raspberry. Raspberry is my least favorite, so I'll try it first. I just ate a cookie. Doesn't taste like anything. But look at that. Mmm. It's not bad. Okay. This is the chocolate one. This is like the filling. pistachio one is the one I'm most excited about. Can't taste it. Mm. It's not too sweet. Maybe the cookie I just ate was just really sweet, but this is like... Mm. Yeah, this is good. They're my favorite one. Pistachio macarons are the first macarons I've learned how to make.